there's our oil filter right there so now it's super easy to get to and you'll see in the design of this this huge support bar directly under the oil filter so i'm going to be trying out a new product today an oil filter funnel so it'll funnel the oil hopefully into our drain pan and leave it off of this so i always cut a little piece of plastic sheeting to cover that and i'm still going to do that today and maybe always will but i'm also going to try out that funnel and so we'll find out together if it works and also the new product that we're using today the new product i bought off of amazon is called a forma funnel flexible draining tool it's a very simple concept on these cars where you loosen the oil filter as soon as you loosen it oil starts to drip out nothing you can do about it you just turn it a couple turns get away from it let it let the, just that oil that's in there let it drip out and so what this does is it comes flat in this package and then it's got something inside some sort of metal or something that allows you to form it and it stays where you form it it's very simple and then it's made to, to wipe off can't remember if it's made out of silicone or what it's made out of but it's very durable um, so the idea is that I would get my you don't have a lot of clearance in there uh, most vehicles you do so I would put my filter wrench on first so that I know I can get it loose and then I'm going to take this and kind of shove it in there flat and then see if I I may not have enough downward room but I, I'm going to try it so I'm going to form it like that and then I'll move my drain pan out here and we will see how that works first time doing it all right let's give it a shot so i'm gonna loosen it now wait for the mess to come of course i uh i messed up i put my i put my filter wrench on the wrong way i put it on in a way of tightening so i want to loosen so i want to put it on this way turn that around put that in there like that okay should drain right into my to my oil pan so I start loosening I should be getting a mess soon okay okay I got it loose and I'm not getting anything so I'm gonna take this opportunity to maybe get my wrench out Oh, there's the mess. So I can't really get my wrench out, which is kind of not good. But anyway, I'm gonna see what happens if I if I keep loosening this uh, filter. Once you get it loose, you can do it by hand. Be nice if I had room to get my wrench out of the way, but I don't, so that's no big deal. This really isn't a lot of oil. Uh, most cars this funnel would work very nicely in in my uh, crv i haven't had a chance to try it yet but i will the next time and i know it's going to work in there because i have plenty of room under the filter to guide it unlike this one but i think this is still working this doesn't look like a lot of oil but that's a lot of mess if it drips on your crossbars and such i think our filter is off now very close to being off yeah there it is so i'm gonna keep this funnel there kind of push it in while i'm pulling out on my filter there's my filter i'm gonna turn it upside down right there there's my filter wrench and 
I think we're good. Uh, I'll go ahead and take these gloves off because the only f oil that's dripped was off my glove onto my plastic sheeting. I'll take these gloves off. They're done. Grab a rag. Get these couple of drops that came off my glove. So I'm not rolling around in that later. I'm going to carry these gloves over to the trash can. So, got some new gloves on. You can tell by looking that the top of the funnel is clean. So that means that all of it should have gotten trapped in that funnel. So, so we're just going to take this funnel and just set it in our, in our drain pan like that. And this job is done. So uh, please remember to look in the video description uh, for links and helpful tips. And so uh, I hope this video has been helpful for you.